Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with a Final Cut Pro tutorial. And this is for basically absolute beginners or very, very beginners, iMovie users that kind of jumped up. And what we're gonna show you here is how to make blurry video. It's really simple. What I'm gonna do is just drag a piece of video into the timeline here. Let me go ahead and mute this audio so we don't have to deal with it. And what we're gonna do here is actually go over to the right side here, second from the end. We have this little thing called an events browser. Click on that to open it. And I usually set it to all video and audio. And then I'll do a quick search. I want to do for blur or blurry. So let's do blur. Okay, so we notice we have three options here. We have the 360 channel blur. And it'll kind of show us if you click on it and roll your mouse over it or your trackpad over it. Kind of show you what you get on each one. So to figure out which one you want, do you want like a, a little soft focus pull or do you want like complete full blur? And don't worry, once we get this on our video, we can actually control the amount of actual blurriness or out of focusness. So I think I'm gonna go with this first one here, this channel blur. You just go ahead and click and hold and just drag it right on top of the video. And now you have blurry video, so that's easy. But let's do a little bit more than that. Once you drag that actual effect on top of your video, you can go to your inspector here. It's the first icon right here, and it should show right on top. But all of your effects are gonna be in this inspector here. And this will actually allow you to control the amount of blur, to fully blurry to only a little bit blurry, okay? So maybe I want, I don't know, 16%-ish. And I'll go ahead and scroll through so you can see that. Now, what I wanted to do is I wanted to have the video in the background blurry and in the foreground, I wanted a completely in focus, non blurry video. So we'll just grab the exact same video clip, drag it right on top. I'm gonna mute the sound here. I am gonna actually reduce the size of it by clicking on this transform icon here. You have multiple icons here. Go ahead and click transform. And the controls for transform are right here. So let me turn that on. And I'm gonna go ahead and drag it. Oops, make sure I get the corner of that. We're gonna go ahead and drag that to scale it, okay? So I'm gonna scale it pretty small so you can see. And what I want is the exact same video playing, the exact same out of focus in the background and in focus in the foreground. And you'll notice the news or other media outlets use this kind of technique when you have those straight up and down portrait videos, but you want to actually have more than just the center showing. That's it for this kind of beginner's tutorial. I'm going to start doing a lot more of these because I know a lot of the folks that have watched my iMovie tutorials are kind of wanting to make the jump to Final Cut. So I'll start to kind of sprinkle in a little bit of Final Cut videos and maybe this will encourage you to make that step for the upgrade or not. You know, maybe you don't need it. It's not necessary to spend 199 and do this. Only if you edit a lot of video and you're trying to save time and do a little bit more advanced editing, I, I would recommend that you upgrade. Okay, that's it for today's tutorial. Thanks for watching. As always, peace, aloha, see you next time.